Gonna react to the other new episode. She's all bat. Oh my god! Our club has its very Spun his club. head around like an owl. Sigh, we asked everyone at school, and they said no. Twas the final nail in our coffin. The Mortician's Club is dead. Wait, there's one person we haven't asked. Lola's our last hope. Lucy, you have to go ask her to join. I, uh, never interrupt Lola while she's strutting. Family rule. Uh, no, please. <sighs> Guys, you don't understand. She doesn't like funeral marches. She won't wear black. Trust me, she's not right for our club. This is the only way. Fine. Remember, I do private pageant coaching. My usual hourly rate applies. Lola, I have to ask you something. The Mortician's Club needs one more member or we'll have to break up. Would you join? What? Not interested? Well, thanks anyway. Wait! Believe it or not, there is a heart under all this fabulousness. I have always considered it my personal mission to spread glitter and glamour to every corner of this earth. So yes, I'll join. Yay! <laughs> meeting to order. Psst, Lucy, shall we start with a few words from our new member? Oh, I didn't prepare a speech. That's okay, Lola. <laughs> JK, JK. <clears throat> For as long as she can remember, Lola Loud has been a giver. It all started with... <gasps> well said. Thank you for your words. Okay. Whoa! Time to review old business. Dante, how are the club clubs coming? <laughs> Perfect. Any other old business? Um, yeah, this chill out here is getting old and my business is freezing. We like the bone chilling cold. Actually, it is pretty chilly. It is right. I agree. I say we go back to my place for some yummy rose hip tea. Boy swans, yummy tea. Crumble. <laughs> now that we're settled, I'll demonstrate funeral makeup techniques. Any volunteers? Me, me. Okay, Boris. <gasps> Sorry, it's just, um, why not add a hint of color for the afterlife, huh? May I? I love this too lively. This will be a total disaster. Voila! Black mascara. Only better. <laughs> Patience, everyone. Keep chanting your hypnotic spells. <laughs> Lola, this spell doesn't include ribbons. I'm just trying to liven it up. It doesn't need. What the hell? <laughs> Man, all those frogs. Frogs, we love all Can those ribbonings. Take over my club. That dumb school club's act ruined everything. 
I wish Principal Huggins had never found it. Wait, that gives me an idea. Ha 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 ha. Lucy, please. Your diabolical laughter is upsetting my unstable isotopes. Ha 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 ha. Is there way too much? Not at all. You bring Gunflam to a whole new level. Hey there, kids. Principal Huggins, such a surprise. What are you doing here? I found this tape to my computer monitor. Don't know how I missed it before. It's the school club's amendment of 1875. Cancels out the seven-member rule. As you were then. <laughs> well, Getting uh, attacked by a bunch of crows again. Anymore. Thank you for your service. Please accept this cloak as our parting gift. Get home safe. Oh, um, okay. Well, I guess I'll be on my way. All right, any old business? I want Lola to stay in the club. I've never felt so fabulous. She really <laughs> mixed things up. I enjoyed her upbeat presence. Boy, it's true. Never left! I was hoping you'd want me to stay. I'm having such fun, and I've got so many great ideas! Three words, goth beauty pageant! <gasps> I have to get Lola out before she ruins my club. But how? Ah! Sky Demon! Get me out of Spiders. This is Deborah. She likes to cuddle. Get that thing away from me! Boris, my seven foot. Yeah, I hate spiders. <laughs> Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, she's been exposed. Yeah, I'm running out of recording time on here. Just hold on a sec. Oh, 